hello guys welcome back to this channel big journal so concerning the video that i made about google view 3 a lot of you are asking me that you are not able to subscribe to the one month free plan because they require you to impute your card details yes the truth is that you need a card before you be able to subscribe to google view 3 but you don't need to worry there are other ways yes there are ways that i used to bypass this because i know that a lot of you wouldn't want to use your own personal card before you use that one month free plan and then google requires you to use your card by force so that's why i came out with this video to create a video on how to bypass this you are going to be using card but this is not your own personal card there's a particular card that we are going to be creating for free without using our own personal card and with this card you are going to be having a us information yes for example i based in nigeria and instead of me to use nigeria as my country if i create this card i'm not going to be using nigeria as a country but rather usa do you understand for example my zip code instead of my zip code to be a nigeria zip code i'm going to be using a us zip code my country is going to be a us my home address that i'm going to be using is going to be a us home address so with this card we are going to be bypassing all these things so make sure to pay very close attention so you don't miss any important part of this video do you understand you may be thinking the card is going to cost you they are going to ask you to put a whole lot of money before you create this card no you don't need to worry the card is also free so make sure to pay very close attention to this video i don't like too much talk without further ado let's jump right into the video okay guys for you to do this the first thing that you have to do is to head over to play store we need an app search for ever send yes ever send app look at the app yes this particular app you just have to go ahead and install it as for me i've already installed it so that is why you are seeing it like this okay so just make sure that you install this app that is what we are going to be using to create our virtual card so after you install the app as you can see go ahead and click it if you are opening it for the first time you are going to be asked to register the registration process is a very simple one okay you just require your email your name and then after that one you'll be asked to get verified okay that verification you just need a very simple detail like just provide anything like nin service okay and then it took me just one minute or two minutes and i'm done setting everything up okay so it's a very simple something okay and here we are on the interface so this is how the app look like this is the interface of the app okay okay guys so if you if you register successfully after you have registered successfully sorry i wasn't able to you know I wasn't able to record the process of registering but it's very very simple okay so you don't need to be panicked so after you register then you have to fund it for you to fund it, you just have to come here as you can see if you look very well you see funding go ahead and fund it and then if you see i already have a virtual bank with them don't understand look at this one now this is a virtual account but as a new beginner you see create this you come here you see create do you understand these two either use this mono or use this normal bank okay so click i will prefer i'll recommend it to use this first one that bank transfer that but you are going to see create then you just have to go ahead and click it if you click that create it will ask you to request virtual bank account like this type now like this one do you understand i've already have one so there's no need for me to request another one so you just have to go ahead and click request because me i already have this one if you look very well there's this global bank okay so now after you create this card they give you this type of bank account look at this my own this my bank account. this is my bank account so now i just have to transfer money from my local bank account to this particular account and this is the bank name global bank and your name will be there so you just need to fund it okay so after you have funded you are going to be seeing the money like this like this 42.1 naira okay you are going the money is going to show here automatically on your wallet okay if you're in ghana the money will be showing in ghana cities okay you depend on how on the wallet it depend on the wallet that you are using okay like me i'm in nigeria so that's why the money is showing in naira depend on the, any amount that you deposit is going to be showing on your wallet then after it's showing like this go ahead and click this exchange okay if you click this exchange now you are exchanging it to dollar right click dollar 
one dollar nine is equals to one thousand six hundred and fifty five point zero seven okay i would recommend you to make sure you deposit money that will give you at least one point five dollar do you understand make sure you, the money that you deposit is up to one point five dollar if you exchange it okay so that you not have issue then go ahead and type the amount that will give you one point five dollar okay for example let me see i want to exchange like just three thousand now you see three thousand will give me one point eight dollar but let me see let me reduce it to two seven okay so this one is enough save or two five just in a hair like this two five so when you are deposit your money make sure you deposit money up to two five okay if you are in nigeria after this you this continue as you can see if you look very well you see continue so you just have to go ahead and click continue okay but if you look very well my balance is 4.2 that's why this continues as i click it is not going because i don't actually have money on it i'm not using it for anything again okay i don't have money on it i only use it to get that card and connect it on my google view tree so that is it so after you immediately you create that continue immediately you, immediately you click this continue the card will be generated for you you it will automatically it will just take few seconds and then they will generate a virtual card for you okay so after you have created the card successfully just come here come here to create the card will only cost you one dollar actually i just say you should put 1.5 dollars so that they will not be seen insufficient you understand so you will not encounter some issue because the money will not be exactly one dollar okay it must be at least even though if it is 1.1 dollar do you understand so that's why i just say you should use something that is at least more than one dollar so 1.1 or 1.2 self will work because we only need one dollar to create the card okay so now after you have created the card successfully come here click your card if you click your card as you can see i already have card look at my card so this card now all you need from this card is this your number okay this number this card number as you can see and then your ccv and then your date of expiring the date of expiring okay that this is what you need if i click it if i click the card i'm going to see all these details i just don't want to show it if you want to show it just go ahead if i click this card like you are seeing all this one that is asterisk if i click it all the details will be showing i don't want to show it on this video okay so that is it as you can see if you look very well it's one dollar yes it's one dollar that i used to create the card and the one dollar is there not that they want to carry it to not that they will take it no they are not going to take it the one dollar is actually there okay so now another thing very important that you need is your billing address do you understand your billing address is very very important now let me click the billing address so this is what you are going to copy copy all these things both this card number and then this your billing address and then head over to google view tree and then provide all this information to subscribe okay so if you click if you want to scroll if you want to subscribe on your google view tree they are going to ask for your street your town your country like me that i'm in nigeria if i go to google view tree instead of me to choose nigeria as my country i'm not going to choose nigeria i'm going to be choosing usa yes and then they are going to ask for my address those are the address that i'm going to use my country if you look very well all the information that you need is here country usa state new york zip code is there town new york street broadway second floor you see you have all the information so now all your information is usa instead of you to choose nigeria me that i'm based in nigeria i'm choosing usa every my information is usa now i'm not living in nigeria again no i'm in nigeria but i'm not living in nigeria i'm living in usa like this i have access to everything that usa people are enjoying okay <laughs> i have the access now so this is the information that i'm going to use on this card i'm using this information with this card so copy all your card billing address copy your card billing address and then copy your card details okay your billing address your card details copy everything and then head over to google view tree and then provide all the information that they require any information that they require on google view tree these are the information that you are going to be using all this information that is what you are going to be using don't use any of your information in nigeria mm -mm, don't use it use every information if you're in ghana don't use any information on ghana use every information that is from here your card number use here only the name that is going to be shown just your name only you are going to be using there's not even a place to provide the name so don't worry about the name so this is how you are going to do it 
get all this information head over to google view 3 and provide it and then boom everything will work successfully okay so this card is very very okay and then if you are done using it maybe before the end of the month or before the end of the 15 month free try just come here and remove your card yes unsubscribe from google view 3 and remove your card if you want remove it if you want delete it if you want to continue using it continue but after everything when the when the time that they give you when the access free that they give you is about to expire make sure that you unsubscribe it but for me i don't even have any money there so it's not important to me if i like i unsubscribe i don't unsubscribe they are not going to debit me because there's no money there and it's not my personal card okay so after getting all your card details just come over here go to chrome search for view 3 search for view 3 and then scroll up and then you see this google deep mind and then you see try flow okay go ahead and click try flow and then you see create with flow go ahead and click it and then go ahead and choose your account and then you'll be asked to subscribe do you understand you'll be asked to subscribe so for you to subscribe all you need to do go ahead and click subscribe and then if you look very well you see but they say of they say the first one month is as is absolutely free look at it zero naira per month so the first one month is free so now you, have, you want to subscribe right go ahead and click get ai pro agree to the attempts and condition And then you see but they will ask you to provide your card details okay you will ask to provide the card details you see go ahead and provide the card details and then go ahead and put that ccv that, that your card details that you get from that ever send go ahead and provide it provide your address as you can see for me to click the address i'll click this pencil icon if you click this pencil icon it will take you to the address okay so, so if you click that pencil icon to take you here the country make sure you don't you do not choose nigeria choose usa my address the address was provided on that ever send application do you understand your the address that i asked you to copy from that app from that ever send app that is the address that you are going to use okay your your city you know it is you you know it is new york your city you know it is new york on that app okay your postal code everything was provided on that card on that application where you generate that card from okay that is the uh, that that is the detail that you are going to be using okay go ahead and provide all the details required okay so this is basically how to create ever same card that you can connect to your google view tree with this you'll be able to subscribe to google view tree and use the one month free plan i hope you find this video helpful if you do please don't just go subscribe to this youtube channel if you are watching from youtube and don't forget to like this account follow this account if you are watching from facebook instagram or tiktok and pick john up as per usual friend hand to head salute bye